speak on any topic without preparation. Friends, many a times we get into a situation where we are called upon stage or dais to speak few words in front of the audience and we may not be prepared to speak. Now in today's video, I will talk about a simple technique which will enable you to speak on topic without preparation. And this is not only about professional public speaking in any situation when you are not prepared when you do not have a mental plan to present in front of others you can use this technique and it will be quite helpful so with that said let's move into the video now before we go into the technique let's understand what is the challenge the main challenge here is when we have to speak on something without preparation we do not have the time to organize our thoughts and when we don't have a plan we cannot create thoughts in sequence and because of that whatever we speak may not be very sensible or may not look very organized so for that we need to understand one thing that in impromptu speaking the key challenge is to organize the thoughts without having much time and that's the one thing which this technique will help but there is an important thing to understand if we do not have language command then this technique may not be very helpful this is presuming that you have decent language command and you have a topic to speak about which you have some kind of knowledge but but only that you do not have a organized content ready with you only in that situation this technique helps in other situation it may be little bit of help but it cannot compensate for your language incompetencies okay with that said let's understand what is this the technique is very simple and it is called q and a technique question answer technique the way our mind thinks is in questions and answer the challenge when we are speaking without preparation is our mind goes blank we do not know what to speak next we don't have the organization so for that we can ask some simple set of questions which are related to that topic to ourselves we don't have to ask and say these questions loudly to the audience this is these are the questions just for our mind to find out a way for example if you are given a topic to talk about youtube then you can ask some simple set of questions what is youtube how it is useful what are good things about it what are not so good things about it what are the uses of it you can say few things for example i could say youtube is a social media platform which is basically a video sharing facility so many creators make their video and so many people watch it free of cost by doing this creators can earn money through advertisements on their videos and the viewers can watch some good content at free of cost so this is one of the biggest video sharing platform in the world and the owner of this youtube application is the google company now you can talk about the good things for example you could say youtube is good to share great ideas it is a good mechanism to get great content without any cost it also can give livelihood to so many people in last few years because of exponential growth of 4g internet and the availability of internet in general so many fresh youtube creators and viewers have come up in indian market now you could talk about some negative aspects negative aspects of it is it is not controlled very well most of the content is controlled by ai and therefore there is a potential risk of misuse misinformation abuse of these things and it can also be very addictive for many people and which can kill their important time so these are few flip side of the youtube platform now if you notice you basically answered few questions in this topic and you could for at least 2 3 minutes now let us say if you are not speaking on a topic and you are just called to talk about something or you are just 
call to say few words then what will what can you say you can start number one by appreciating the organizer the person who has organized the event you can talk about the day the audience the function the facilities the arrangements all those things you can appreciate them that's a nice way to buy some time and start okay then you can talk about your views or if you have some kind of story or incident in your mind which connects to the organizer or to the event or to the theme just talk about that and in the end thank all the people to give you a chance to speak and that's it your 2 to 3 minute or 5 minute can easily be filled so the point here is you need to have some simple set of questions in your mind which you can answer and create these questions on the go related to topic Look around anything and try to talk. And how do we practice impromptu speaking? Few things we need to develop. Number one, you need to develop some decent vocabulary and language command. Number two, you need to have some command over current affairs. We must know a bit about everything. It is useful. And number three, whenever you are sitting idle, you have some time, try to speak on things around you. If you are sitting idle, you could just talk, okay, for example, I am looking into camera and talking. So I can say, this is a camera, there are many kind of cameras. There are three major manufacturers of cameras, Sony, Canon and Nikon. Like that, I could just try to speak and check myself, how long can I speak about a thing called camera. And the more and more I play this game with myself alone or with my friends, I will become better and better in extempore or impromptu speaking. So I hope you will find this technique useful. The important aspect is practice this technique. The more you practice, the better it will be. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, do subscribe. 